to do a follow-up video on one of the thrift bags I picked up last week. It was the uh, Madame Alexander Wizard of Oz thrift bag that I paid $7.99 for. Uh, and I, at the time, I thought it was full. Uh, I've kind of been looking at it as it's been sitting here. I don't think it's full, but I do think there's some cool ones in here that I haven't seen before. So I wanted to open it up and uh, let's take a look at it. Okay, so here's that thrift bag again. Uh, it was $7.99. I probably got 20% off because I always donate, but uh, I see, I've been looking at the prices on these online and they are all over the place. So I'm gonna see how many that we had and which ones they are. So obviously this is Dorothy. Now the problem with Dorothy was one of her ruby slippers is a little bit faded. You can see that on camera the one but she does have toto in the basket so that's pretty good um this figure alone is probably about 10 bucks uh it's current condition maybe more like eight but that is the first one that that's the reason why i got the bag uh the other reason was i have a cowardly lion but i don't have a scarecrow so there's the scarecrow so that's like another six or seven bucks so right there i've already doubled my money this is a member of the lollipop guild the munchkin I don't have that one, but it looks like, if you can see, there's some damage to the sides of his head. Looks like he got chewed on. So that's disappointing. I'll have to look for a better one of those. I believe this is a good witch. I might be wrong. If I'm wrong, let me know in the comments because I'm not entirely up on my uh, Wizard of Oz nostalgia. This might not even be Wizard of Oz, but I think it is. Obviously, we all know this is the Tin Man. Looks like it's in pretty good shape. So that's like another seven bucks. Now I have the whole uh, crew, and then I have a Winky Yard. I don't know uh, if this is supposed to be like that. The hat's supposed to come off or not, uh, but it seems like it's in pretty decent shape. Um, I don't know. I think it's all right. So that'd be like five bucks, give or take, maybe a little bit less, four or five. And then the last one was this one. This is the Wicked Witch of the East. So this is the witch that dorothy lands the house on and i think this is probably the rarest one uh due to the fact that like who remembers the wicked witch of the east and she's got actual ruby slippers that aren't faded so that's probably the find of the bag uh, i'll be honest with you i haven't seen that figure ever in all my years of collecting so there's seven figures for 7.99 it's like less than a dollar 25 a figure and I'd say if I had to ballpark what this lot is worth, if I sold it together, it'd be worth about 30 bucks. If I sold it individually, it might be worth 40. So I'm more than five times my money on this one, um, which is pretty good. Let me know what your favorite character is. Oh, I didn't know their eyes closed like that. It's kind of creepy. Um, I'm partial to Dorothy and the Wicked Witch of the East. Also, uh, the Munchkin is really cool, except for the hair and head damage. Also, the Scarecrow, but... Uh, I would say that the Wicked Witch of the East is the best one. It's probably worth the most too because it's got the tag. Anyway, thanks for watching and stay tuned because I got a lot more great stuff coming up.